Hey, fatty! I just hit the 48-hour mark of my open-ended hard dry fast. When I say hard dry fast, that means no water contact. Um, last night, I felt like shit. You know, I felt good mentally, but I was super weak, you know, getting out of bed. And now today I feel awesome because my body finally made that hardcore fucking shift where I'm roasting fucking ketones now. So, here's some fresh piss. I'll show you what dry fasting gets you for ketones after about 48 hours. I actually was pissing this color before 48 hours, but I just took this leak just now. So, we're showing pretty dark now. <laughs> it's as dark as it's going to get, okay? So I'm right close to fucking the mat. I'm basically maxed out. So just to simplify some things for some people that are confused about ketones. So obviously I haven't drank any water. So my ketones are going to be definitely more concentrated, okay? Secondly... If you just got into this diet and you just started fasting, your kidneys are not going to be that well adapted to uptaking ketones right away. So when you very first start this diet, you're going to show fucking crazy high ketones even drinking water. Then eventually your kidneys get more efficient at uptaking the ketones. That's basically acetoacetate is what these pick up. That's the ketone that these pick up. There's three ketones. There's acetoacetate beta hydroxybutyrate and acetone these ones pick up acetoacetate these strips okay so when you get adapted to this stuff your kidneys will get more efficient at kicking the acetoacetate back into your body so if your ketone strips show a little less color after a while it's okay you're still going to be in deep ketosis but when you very first start this it'll show fucking like dark like this like this is, I'm dry fasting too, but there's gonna be people that are water fasting that's gonna show this dark like within a couple days of starting, then it might not be as dark after a while, okay?